Hello and welcome to Normal Game Couch and welcome to the Universal Monster Station Wagon Zombie Dragon Tour. I'm joined uh, with my co-host here, Mrs. Elfman. Hello. And today we're going to be playing Oregon Trail. Not to be confused with Oregon Trail from the 80s. This is a lot like Oregon Trail, but it's a parody game. It, uh, it's kind of the same idea. You're heading west. Yeah. And uh, you're riding around in a, a wagon, only instead of a covered wagon, it's a station wagon. And this kind of pays homage to all those zombie movies. You oh, get yeah. A band of survivors trying to survive. Trying to get from point A, point, point A to point B. Trying to get to the safe zone. Yeah. Um, so, we're going to go ahead and start a new game here. I got a couple games going already. But we're going to start a new game. Okay. And it's going to be the campaign. I was thinking we'd play endless mode. Mm -hmm. But I kind of I kind of dig the idea of playing the campaign on the stream. Yeah, I like the campaign. And we're gonna play uh, normal for normal game couch. Makes sense. All right. Now, even though I'm joined here with Mrs. Elfman, we're not gonna play co-op mode because it kind of just obfuscates the gameplay. So we're just gonna go ahead and, and keep it simple here. Yeah, I'll just help with decision making and such. Yeah, yeah. I'll kind of run run things by her and. Get her opinion from time to time. So we can pick a uh, protagonist here. I'm going to go ahead and pick the dude. <laughs> okay. And we'll skip the intro. Clements will be sad, but that's okay. <laughs> Alright, who is the party leader? I'm going to go ahead and make myself the party leader. All right, now we named this the Universal Monster Station Wagon Zombie Dragon Tour. So, all of the uh, all of our uh, party you know, members party members are going to be named after actors who played univ Universal Monsters, the classic Universal Monsters, Dracula, Phantom of the Opera, so on, so on. Um, Good stuff. Yeah. So we'll name uh, we'll name the first one here, Bella, after Bella Lugosi. Of Dracula fame. Of Dracula fame. And we'll name the second one Lon, after Lon Chaney, who played the Phantom of the Opera. One right. of my fa personal favorites. And then... Both the horror and the musical. <laughs> Lon Chaney Jr., who played uh, the Mummy and the Wolfman. Awesome. We'll just name him Lon J.R. Jr., He'll be like the uh, the Carl of the group. Coral, Coral. <laughs> and uh, of course, we got Boris Karloff here, who played Frankenstein's monster. Boris. I think he's going to be the muscle. <laughs> <laughs> With a name like Boris, so Bella's going to be like the brains of the operation. Mm -hmm. Lon's just going to be like the tag along. Lon 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 Junior is going to be the like Coral. the Carl, like the. <laughs> We gotta pick up his slack. And Boris is gonna be the muscle. At least, at least to start with. Are these names correct? Yes. Yes. And it wouldn't be the uh, station, the Universal Monster Station Wagon Zombie Dragon Tour if we didn't use the station wagon. We got the SUV unlocked. I'm working on unlocking some of these other ones. But all we have un unlocked right now is the station wagon, the SUV. We'll go with the station wagon. Sounds good. Okay, so I kind of, I've kind of done this a few times and I kind of know what I want to start with. Yeah. We're going to bump up fuel to 24. We're going to bump up food to 375. Ammo 200. Tires 2. Mufflers 2. Batteries 2. Money 50. Med kit 5. What do you think about that? Sounds pretty good. Sounds pretty, uh, like a pretty good staple you're starting out with. I mean, I've done this a few times, and I've kind of, I've kind of got it down. I think this is what we need to start with. Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. So right off the bat, 
Well, one of the things that's cool about this game is we kind of pick where we want to go. Now, the, the green here represents a, uh, a, a like a radiation, radiation zone. zone. Um, oftentimes, it doesn't really offer anything too much better than than the non irradiated alternative. So true. So you might as well not chance it and hurt yourself, right? Yeah. I mean, we got light light supplies here and a med kit scavenger. Mm -hmm. Med kit scavenger is actually pretty good. What that does is allows you to find med kits during scavenging. That is pretty good. It is pretty good. Decent but supplies, supplies are better there. Yeah. And there's good tires you could buy. Yeah. Possibly. If you scavenge and get more money. So we'll head out to, to Pittsburgh here. 276 miles from Pittsburgh. So here's our uh, our basic stats, our health stats here. Green is good. Uh, when you get um, infected or whatever, it, it changes color. Yeah. People can die off. That'll probably happen. Oh, by the <laughs> way, I wanted to mention we're playing with a self-imposed rule here. As we're driving along the road, we'll come across different scenarios. Yeah. If I was playing, like, alone, I would probably not go investigate these things. Like, if I was playing with the end in mind... Mm -hmm. I would be min-maxing this game, you know what I'm saying? So I wouldn't, I would just get there as quick as possible, make speed my priority, get yeah, to no where Yeah, no side tra dragon. <laughs> but to make it more interesting here, the self-imposed, you know, for the stream, the self-imposed rule is we are stopping to look at everything that we come across. Make it All a little right. more interesting. It'll probably mean that we're not going to make it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we're starting off with 24 cans of fuel. 375 ounces of food. Uh, there's not a lot of zombie activity right now. 276 miles to the next landmark, and we've we're just starting out. Yep. So let's press here to continue. Lon, oh jeez, Lon Junior having the measles. Already. I told you. I told you he was going to be the trouble one. I, I knew it. You didn't vaccinate him. Nope. <laughs> I won't get into that on the stream. Yeah, don't get into that. No politics. Controversy, man. <laughs> Controversy. We wait an hour while Lon has a panic attack. Pro Aww. Probably worried about his son. Probably. probably and you know all the zombies. About, yeah. Yeah. What's I'd be the, worried about that too. Yeah, zo zombie zombies activity getting is is getting up there. Mm -hmm. Went from low to medium, so it could be a combo of everything. I, I'd be panicking as well. All right, let's let's head out. You drive over some radioactive sludge and your tire melts. So oh, you replace wow. it from supplies. I think we had two tires to start yeah, off with. We got. It doesn't say it here, but yeah, we have one tire left. So hopefully it doesn't uh, screw us here. Or <laughs> this will be a very short game. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Nothing happened there. <laughs> I guess it was just a pit stop found some wild fruit, so that Ooh. should increase our uh, food. I don't know what it was at, because it's going down at each, like, each time we move ahead a bit, it goes down some, yeah. based on the number of people we have in our party. So I'm sure that added to our total. Mm -hmm. Whatever that was. Wild fruit. What's going on? Creeping into Pittsburgh here. Lon cracks his skull. Holy wow. cow. Man, we're just getting started, dude. That's major. Yeah. I wonder what I wonder what the implication of that is. Maybe he was having a panic attack and he hit his head against the Oh window. yeah. Yeah, could be. Could be. No offense against people who have panic attacks because I myself have them as well. So oh, yeah. that was not that was not a cut. Yep, I've had them. <laughs> Alright, so we're in Pittsburgh now. Um, you know what? I am going to turn on the music, because this is kind of weird with Yeah, that. it is weird with, like, no music. Can Let's, we even do that? Yeah, we can do that. Um, it saves... Don't leave town! Yeah, no, don't leave town. I'm looking here. Okay, there uh, we go. Options. Yeah, put a little bit of music. You know what? We might actually have to go out to the main menu and come back Oh, in. son of a gun. It's saved, though. Okay. The men who wear many hats. 
Yeah, we gotta help Ben Crossbones. <laughs> Props to Ben Crossbones. There we go. A little bit of music. Yeah, I like the music. It's just I was concerned that people wouldn't be able to hear because we're using a different microphone today. I think it'll be okay. But I that mean, should be okay. it's it's enjoyable music. It it kind of sets the tone. All right. So back to where we were here. Yep. Pittsburgh. Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. So let's take a look at our party. Um, Lon and Lon Jr. are not doing so great. Yeah. I mean... Resting might help, though. Resting might help. I'm, I mean, we, ha we, we only have, have five med we kits. We have five med kits. Let's, let's take a look and see what the town's got here. We can earn 67 food for a normal job, $22 for a dangerous job. Nothing that really helps us all, all that much. Um, no. Let's see if anyone wants to trade. Maybe we can get a med kit for something that we have a lot of. Maybe. No one to trade with. Okay. Let's see what the... Let's talk to someone in town. I'm not sure what caused all this. If it were a virus, how did it spread so fast? And why are we immune? Are we immune? Yeah, I don't think you're immune. I think you just have to die and then... Yeah, that, that's wishful happens. thinking there. Hasn't that guy ever seen any zombie movies? Yep. Or television shows, or comic books, or... Wanna just, ki wanna <laughs> just kill Lon Games. Chaney Jr. right off the bat? No! Okay. He's only got measles. That won't kill you if you have the proper treatment. It'll kill him if I kill him. <laughs> we'll see what happens. I um, mean, he's not that far gone. The rest might help him. Yeah, In a situation let's, let's like rest. this when you don't have antibiotics. We'll rest a couple hours. Okay. I want Lon Chaney Jr. to get rid of those measles. Yeah. Uh. It's not worth wanna using. Wanna go fishing? Mm, no. And I don't think it's worth using a uh, med kit on any of them. No, I don't think so either. We'll try fishing once. Yeah, because that has the same effect, right? See? As resting, yeah, it yeah. does. And then maybe you get some food. Three ounces of food. Pretty small salmon. Yeah. I don't really fish too much in this game. See, Lon, Lon Jr. Jr. no longer has the measles. He is and cured. And everybody's in pretty good health, too. So it helped out. Yeah, it did. Car's doing okay. Mm-hmm. I mean... We would repair it with scrap. We have 10 scrap. That's not a lot. What is, uh, zombie activity is deadly. We can't really scavenge right now. It'd be too dangerous. Yeah, not, a, not an option. I think I might just let the car go for now and really try to repair it at the next place. Good idea. I think that, I think we'll be okay. Unless we lose our tires. <laughs> and we're just dead on the road. Yeah, because we got one tire, one spare tire left. This town actually has an auto shop. Well, let's see here. Oh, two dollars over. Well, that's the special. The tires are 45. Oh, okay. See, the special would be uh, super, super last, last tires. tires. Less likely for tires to break. That'd be great, too. Yeah. But uh, we can't really afford that, so barely afford regular tires. We'll buy we'll buy a tire. This will give us one tire, I think, right? Two. It, it, oh, it's two? You get two tires each No, it gives one? us one, but I mean it will have two. Oh, okay. <laughs> but I mean buying it will give us one more tire. One more tire, yes. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Buy. Five bucks left. We is broke. It's like real life. <laughs> broke is a joke. All right, man. So we're back up to two extra tires. Got our batteries, mufflers, five bucks in the coffers. <laughs> Ammo's doing good. Med kits are okay. Food's good. 
Uh, we got we got a decent amount of scrap. Hopefully, we can scavenge at the next location. Yeah. Fuel is doing really good. All right. What yeah, do you, what you say we head out, man? Sounds good. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna open on screen chat. Okay. Because we got someone in the room here. So just hold on a second. Opening on screen chat. in the room anymore. Want to head out or? Sure. Sounds yeah. good to me. Leave town. I think everything's okay. All right, so our next location is the mall. Light supplies, med kit scavenger. All right, med kit scavenger. I, I really want that med kit scavenger, but I don't know. We'll have to see. I mean, we've got five bucks right now. Yeah. Oh, that's something you have to buy. Yeah, it's a, it's like a perk that you can buy. Okay. Yeah. We'll have to see what kind of jobs. Maybe there's jobs that give us money. Okay, here we go. A horde of zombies in order to continue on the road. The horde in front of you is currently massive in size and appears to be agitated. That's Great. not good. All right, so we can uh, wait to see if the horde disperses. Break out guns and clear a path. Attempt to sneak through. Hmm. Let's get the information on our choices here. Good idea. You can attempt to sneak through the horde. If the zombies aren't very aggressive looking, you might be able to slowly drive through them without drawing their attention. You can also fight your way through. You will attempt to drive through the horde at top speed, firing from the windows as you go. A large and angry horde may still be able to overwhelm the vehicle. While well, they are large and angry. Ugh. So it sounds like... Uh, Firing our fighting our way through is not a good option. No. And we didn't get the option about mercenaries nearby, so mm. I guess we'll wait and see if they disperse. Yeah, it looks like that's our best option right now. We could try to. Because they're massive through. and agitated. Yeah, we'll do, we'll wait and see what happens. Good, they're docile now. Docile, okay. So now is when we do the sneak through or the. Break out the guns and clear a path. If they're if if they're docile and we break out the guns, maybe it would rile them up. Again. Yeah, it might agitate them again. Let's just try to sneak through. Okay. Stay under the radar and sneak through. What do you think? Sounds good to me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it looks like we did it. it. Looks like we did it there. Yeah. Suck through the horde. Awesome. You find a usable upgrade to your car while clearing a trash heap. Cool. What I wonder is what it? the upgrade is. <laughs> uh, we'll find out at the next stop. I could stop and, and set up a camp here by picking that selection out. But, yeah. Uh, I, I don't. I don't want to. I don't no. want to stop, man. You just open yourself up for trouble. I want to get to the next. Yeah. Safe zone. Well, hey, look at that. Rummage through two. You rummage two med kits off a body at the side of the road. Awesome. Awesome. Now we have seven med kits. That's pretty good, man. Mm-hmm. Lon Jr. is dicking with two fuel <laughs> and accidentally ruins it. I don't even want to know what that means. What does that mean? I don't want to know. Lon Jr., get off the fuel fuel tank. Get off the fuel cans. Get in the house. Get in the house. <laughs> What does that mean? I don't, I, I really don't know. I think it means like he's messing around with it. All like right. when you say someone dick, is dicking around. Yeah. That's odd though. <laughs> I know. <laughs> all right. I guess we know what Ron Jr. is all about. Yeah, getting into trouble and getting the measles. Yeah. <laughs> you hear gunfire from nearby buildings. All right, let's keep going. <laughs> What's everybody's health at? Pretty good. Station wagon needs to be repaired, but we can yeah. deal with that. All right. That's so we're at the mall. <laughs> Apaco. <laughs> yeah, left left for dead reference there. Left to die. Mm-hmm. Apaco. All right. 
All right. All right, man. For, first off, let's look at the jobs because I would love to repair. There's a job where you can repair. Yeah, hit and hit run. and run. For every ten of those things you can kill in forty seconds, I'll fix your car up a little bit. Yeah, I like this one. Yeah, let's do it. Smash up the zombies with your car. <laughs> It's kind of like that achievement in the original Dead Rising. Oh, I love that one. You had to kill like 53,000 zombies or something in the car. Yeah, something outrageous like that. Best place to do that? Parking garage. Yep. Roll them all up in there. <laughs> Round them up. Pretty sparse here, actually. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Yeah. I think I got exactly a hundred. Really? Yeah. I lost count. I wasn't really looking at the num at that part of the screen at the number. Station wagon gets a tune-up. Cool. All right, let's check it out. Yeah, it's doing pretty yeah, good. Yeah, it's better. We'll go to the party. Party's doing good. Yeah. Did you know that if you stop to rest, you can usually overcome any sickness? Resting in a city usually makes you heal up a little faster. Oh, that's good. I actually didn't know that. I didn't either. Good. It's worth talking to the stranger sometimes. I mean, we don't really need... I mean, we're in good health, man. We don't really need anything. Well, what, what's a dra the dragon? What's the zombie uh, situation for scavenging? Oh, well, I was going to check that out in a bit. But it, oh, okay. Like, taking one tab at a time. I get We're you. looking at the party. Party mm -hmm. looks pretty good. Yeah. Car looks Car's okay. Yeah, I'll, decent. I'll probably try to repair it in a bit. Yeah. Uh, zombie activity high. Oh, that's so not good. I may not want to try to scavenge. What kind of here. upgrades do you have? Um, upgrades in on your car because I saw that there's a cow pusher. Oh yeah, that's right. We we it said we got that thing when we were going. It said we got a free upgrade. Oh, so it's automatic. Yeah, we got the the cow the cow the cow thing there. Yeah, cow catcher. Cow catcher. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah, I didn't even really notice that. <laughs> um, that'll probably help us get through zombie hordes, I would think. Yeah, I would think so. Yeah, I don't know about scavenging. I mean, we could probably do it, but it's it's a risk, and I think we could probably make it to the next safe zone without it. Without it. Yeah, I think you're probably right. Combat trainer. We still only have five bucks. That stinks. <laughs> let's see if let's see if anybody wants to trade anything. Being broke sucks. Meet someone who will spare one of their battery for forty-five of your food. <sighs> no, no, I don't think it's worth it. No, because we haven't had a chance to go scavenging yet for food and yeah. such. Yeah, I, I mean, I really want to scavenge, and when we do, when we do find a good place to scavenge. I'm going to do it like five or six times. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Hopefully at the next place. But you know what we can do? Let's rest an hour and see if the zombie activity dies down. It probably won't, but it doesn't hurt to try. Well, let's check it out. Just because the later in the day it becomes... Oh, it did Zombie help. activity medium. Color me wrong. All right, yeah, let's scavenge now. Okay. I like the ones with no legs. Yeah. I have no legs. The ones with the exposed brains take uh, two shots. Yeah, they have slightly larger bodies, too. Yeah. I oh, I forgot like to turn bodies. on Halloween mode. Oh, uh, yeah. That's all right. That's all right. I mean, it's already a, a zombie survival game. Yeah. All right. And... And yeah, that was getting close there. <laughs> found 215 ounces of food while scavenging. Also found 10 scrap. Hot dog. Right on. Possibly. There actually were hot dogs in that food. <laughs> I don't know if I'd want to eat hot dogs during the zombie apocalypse, though. 
Like yeah. Pretty old. Probably <laughs> Gross. Old. Um. I think we. Oh, let's scavenge. Let's scavenge some more. Let's keep going until we can't do it anymore. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Until it becomes too hard, like yeah. the amount of zombies. Or, like, I start getting concerned about ammo. Yeah. Whichever comes first. Mm-hmm. Money. Yeah. I think that's all that's gonna... Oh, nope, there's some more. Scrap. Oh, that other survivor's gonna get it. Stupid bandit. If you shoot him, you can get it, yeah. Yeah, I mean, I just became the bad guy, but I mean, it's a video game. Well, so. maybe he was a bandit. You had this place staked out first. Yeah. Found 100 ounces of food while scavenging and five dollars and 20 scrap. Not bad. Not bad, but more than five dollars would be nice. I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep going. Alrighty. Sometimes you can find a like a bag of money that's worth fifty. Yeah, I know those are awesome. I wish those popped up in real life. Yeah, I know, like a bag like of a fifty dollars. Stack with a dollar sign on it, <laughs> like it's from a cartoon or something. That fast-moving zombie stops moving if I face his direction. He's kind of like Boo. Ah. Oh, that was close. Zero ounces of food, 35 scrap. So all you got was scrap from that one? That yeah. was lame. We'll keep going. Alrighty. I mean, you gotta scavenge while the scavenging is good, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Not a lot of zombies around. This is the time to go out and look for goods. Oh, yeah. something way down, way uh, upper right hand and then lower left hand corners of the screen. I know, that's crazy. Oh, there's no way I'm getting over there in time now. Uh, well, that's right. And we got another guy, yeah. Ah, you got eaten by a zombie. Uh. <laughs> All right. Lots of 30 food. ounces. Wow, we got it. we're getting good on food. Yeah. I remember the first time we played through this, we were good on food. Yeah, we too. had like 2,000 food. Yeah. It was it, crazy. It was pretty good. Going out again, dude. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, doesn't like, hurt. Like, we have a good, a good opportunity here to scavenge. I'm going to take it. Mm-hmm. I don't blame you. Food. By the way, uh, it should be addressed that today <laughs> is Halloween. I don't think we we mentioned that vocally on the stream. Yeah, and for anyone watching the stream later on on uh, archived and on yeah, YouTube, YouTube, they may not know that for sure. Yeah. So happy Halloween, everybody! Yeah, happy Halloween, my favorite day of the year. <laughs> <laughs> it is. We did a uh, earlier today. We did a. Uh, like a Halloween costume walk thing. Yeah, kind of like a big town block party thing. It's pretty fun. Yeah. We do it every year. Yep. Get away. I'm the bad guy. I kill you. I kill you. I kill you. I, uh, yes. you dressed up as a zombie. Yes, I did. So it's quite befitting of the game we're playing on the stream tonight. Mm-hmm. And I dressed up as Clementine from, uh... Walking, Walking Dead. Walking Dead video game. Yep. She's awesome. Yeah, yeah. And yes, yes, she was like a 13-year-old girl, but hey, she's an awesome one, so it's worth it. You know, I I literally consider her character a hero to me. Yeah, because she's, she's awesome. So dude. courageous. Yeah. I, I strong. I have a, a profound respect for her as a character. 
great writing in the in those games. That, yeah. By the way, for anyone who hasn't played them, amazing gameplay, amazing writing, just yeah. a great game. They're Both really just great. I mean, I, I love those games. Oh, and isn't uh, in Nove- uh, November uh, the second season? Oh yeah, is going season to be two great. is on PlayStation Plus. So if you have PlayStation Plus in November, uh, season two of The Walking Dead is free. Yep. And that's season two of the video game, not to yeah. <laughs> confuse anybody here. Yeah, it kind of plays as an episodic type of game, but they're awesome. Highly recommended. So I got to mention, and I, I'm sure you don't want me mentioning this. <laughs> I know what you're going to say. But when we were out on the costume walk, uh, we were walking by a group of like 13, 14 year old girls. Yeah. Probably, uh, probably one of these types of girls that are on Tumblr. And don't really know what the world is don't like. Don't really know what the world is like, and <laughs> they, one of them. Not point, that everyone on Tumblr is, yeah. but you know the stereotypicals. One one of them pointed at me, and I was dressed as Clementine, a female, and one of them pointed at me and said, "That right there is sexist." <laughs> Which how is it sexist to dress up in a costume? As someone that you admire. Yeah, I mean, regardless like, of what the like what they like are. Like I said, man, I chose I chose the costume I chose. <laughs> I chose the character I chose because I have a deep, profound respect for the character, man. And that's how I pick all my costumes. I, you know, I. Uh, well, last year you were Prince Ashitaka last from year uh, I was Princess Mononoke. Pr- exactly, I was Prince Ashitaka from Princess Mononoke. Again, I have a deep, profound respect for the character. And the year before that, I was Ness, and I mean... From Earthbound? From Earthbound, and if you've played Earthbound, you, you're aware that that there's like a... I mean, it, it look, on the surface, it's like a weird, funny, you know, parody RPG game, but mm-hmm. when you really get down to it, it's, it's a story about, like, friendship and, and the trials through hardship and all that, and... Coming in, a kid coming into his own and yeah. growing up and... yeah. Like leaving home, saving and, the and world, basically becoming, becoming, you know, maturing and becoming his own person. And mm-hmm. it, it's a really, you know, so I don't pick a character to to dress up for it as Halloween that I don't respect and admire. So I do apparently because I picked <laughs> I was a zombie this year. I don't necessarily respect zombies. But I'm just saying, like <laughs> I, I didn't pick Clementine as a joke. No. You know, I, I was serious about it. Of course. But you know, I, I can laugh at these things because as as a gamer, as someone who's, you know, not the young 20-year-old I used to be, I've mm-hmm. been around and I've seen how video games have been treated my whole life and they've always been the whipping, whipping boy for society's ills. So I'm used to this kind of stuff. I'm used to the finger pointing, you know what I mean? Yeah been doing it for for a long time you you found more food on that one than you could even carry back yeah i think we might be good for a while i mean we could still scavenge but Mm -hmm. i'm using up ammo here and yeah uh, i think we're good okay the party's doing good Mm mm-hmm Let's repair the car because we have a lot of a lot of scrap yeah you have a good amount of scrap now so good thinking This is hard, by the way. Oh, yeah. I, I couldn't do it. Kind of reminds me of blacksmithing in, um... What was it? Fable? Yeah, Fable yeah. Two? Blacksmithing in one of those And Fable, Fable 2, I think it was Fable 2. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. It is yeah. a lot like that. It was hard. <laughs> I, I don't have the timing for it. And with backwards compatibility on the Xbox One... I'll be doing the Fable games eventually. Absolutely. That'll Amazing. Be, I love those games. They're so fun. fun. Yeah. I'm going to I'm gonna turn uh, chat off here real quick. On-screen chat, because it's kind of slowed down, so. Yeah. I'd rather have the full screen effect here. Good thinking.
Okay, now everything we've done should have saved. I mean, yeah, yeah. We'll station wagon is is back to almost full health. Mm -hmm. All right, so fuel. If if we can buy fuel, that would probably be good. Yeah, I'd say fuel and maybe ammo. Maybe ammo. Cheap. Wow, fuel's pretty cheap here. Yeah. What was the, uh, hold on, before I spend this money, what was, oh, combat trainer. It's Med 80. kits have a chance of appearing while scavenging. That is a really good thing, though, and you mm -hmm. know I scavenge a lot. Yeah, and it's, it's $80, you need 30 more. I could probably sell some. Yeah, um, probably some food. I could probably, we got a lot of food. You do, so. that's what I'm saying. It's not worth a lot here, but I think that might be okay. Yeah. yeah let's yeah. sell $15 worth of scrap and $15 worth of food. Okay. And that'll give us just enough. Okay. Because that is a great perk. We're going to want that. Yeah. There. Okay. Uh, combat trainer. Combat trainer. Medkit scavenger. Put that there. All right, and it was <laughs> it was fourteen for for a uh, for a, a, a can for of fuel. fuel yeah, I'd, I'd still like to get a couple of those. We could probably sell a little more food. We have like thirteen hundred, or no, yeah, oh, eleven hundred and seventy three. I'll I'll buy one can okay. of fuel. How do I? Oh, bye. <laughs> yeah, I was like I was trying to get up to the oh the thing to the where fuel you thing. The the quantity. Ah, uh, thought you were just getting tired. No. Nah. All right, so we're good on almost everything except money. Yeah, I'd say so. All right, let's let's get out of here. Okay. This place is this place is over. It's stale. This place is over. <laughs> all right, all right, cool jets. Found some wild fruit. All right, more wild fruit. Something catches your eye off the road. Would you like to get out and investigate? Now, see, this is what I was talking about. Normally, I would say no, mm -hmm. but I'm self-imposing this rule where where we we check everything out. Okay. All right, so let's check it out. Sure. You find a campground. There appears to be a number of supplies here. The campfire is still warm, and there are signs that a few people have been living here for a while. They don't appear to be around right now. I wouldn't take their stuff. That's awful. I mean, the, the campfire is still warm, so they, they couldn't have gone far. Yeah. But what if they're dead? I mean, we could take half their stuff. It's up to you. I mean, I've ar I'm already shooting other survivors in the head, so I'm not, <laughs> I'm not playing like, like the virtuous game here. Yeah. I guess we could take half. We'll take half. I mean, you know, we... We could take everything, but we're not. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, listen, if this was The Walking Dead and I was Clementine, and or if I was playing as Lee and I was standing in front of Clementine, I wouldn't take the stuff. Yeah. But But this is this Oregon isn't, Trail. This isn't Walking Dead, man. <laughs> this is Oregon Trail, and we're taking half the stuff. Mm-hmm. You decide to only take what you need. You wouldn't want to be responsible for these people dying. You take 30 food, 20 ammo, a med kit, and $25. Hopefully they won't miss it too much. Oh, they will. They always do. How could they not? Yeah. But it could have been worse. We could have taken everything. Yep. Indianapolis. They I got, love these little bumper yeah, screens. Yeah, these little, these, these like, uh, like pixel art city screens are great. Yeah. I like, I like how the blood is hot pink. Yeah. 
Yeah, I like these. I'd like to get some of these framed on my wall. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. I do have some pixel art framed on my wall, earthbound actually. Yep, gift from me. Yep. When the infection first hit, everyone was in a panic, looting and killing each other. Now they roam the roads chasing vague rumors and hopeless dreams. The roads are blocked with those who failed before them. Aw, sad. Party's doing good. Nobody What's needs car doing? Nobody needs any attention. Car's doing good too. Yeah, what the heck? We're actually doing pretty good. I'm not even gonna worry about repairing it right now. Fuel's okay, scrap's okay, food's good, med kits are great, ammo's okay, tires good, batteries, mufflers good. Man. We're doing good. What's available in town? I'm not going to scavenge because it's deadly. In town we have an auto shop, a couple of jobs, or one job. Not one we probably want to do. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, dealing, I'm not dealing with dangerous difficulty job for twenty dollars no not when we just got twenty dollars on the road yeah for free mm-hmm what's in the auto shop do we need anything from the auto shop no what's the special thing never break muffler for forty seven dollars If we were to get that, well, we don't have the money, but I was going to say, well, if we were to what? get that, we could sell some of our Maybe mufflers. Maybe we could sell two mufflers. How much do we need? We need uh, $22. Yeah. Let's see how much a muffler sells for. Okay. Is it, wait, a muffler is not something you can sell. I don't think it? it is, come to think of it. Yeah, you can't sell a muffler. Poop. But we need 20, we need... $22. And I don't think, um... I don't want to sell fuel. Scrap sells for good here. We could sell 11 scrap and make enough. Really? That's pretty good. Yeah. We could, we could, we have a, a, a pretty good amount of med kits. Let's sell one med kit. You sure? Yeah. One All med right. kit. We have eight. Okay. And we have the thing where we find medkits. We have a long kits, way to go. <laughs> but we, we have the perk where we find medkits when we scavenge. That's right? true. You're right. We did get that, didn't let's, we? Yeah. Let's sell one medkit. Okay. Okay. One medkit sell. And then we'll sell... Uh, Ten scrap? How much? We needed $47? Was that how much we needed? I don't remember. <laughs> Seven scrap. Okay. Okay, and buy... Oh. Auto shop. Auto shop. Yep, 47. 47 yep. Okay, let's buy, let's buy the muffler. Never break muffler. Never needs to be replaced. All right. Now we have no money. It's okay. But we got what we need. <laughs> Do you want to repair the car a little bit? Yeah, we'll... we'll, we'll just a little bit, just we'll once. We'll do a little bit, yeah. A, a, a four? A four, yeah. Pretty good. Hot dog. Pretty good. Hot diggity dog. That that is actually harder than it looks. Oh, I believe it. <laughs> I'm like I said earlier. I'm not good at timed button presses. Everybody's doing great. Let's rest one hour. Okay. And if the zombie activity goes down a bit, I'll scavenge some more. Okay. Nope, stayed the same. Okay. Yeah, I think it's usually at its lowest, like early morning yeah like I mean I, I think it, I think it is kind of random but I think there in is in most cities it seems to be yeah, as low as in the morning I mean I think there there is an algorithm there to it that's based on the day night cycle yeah but I think there's some random elements to that algorithm as well so I don't think yeah I don't think you can base it 100% on the time of day yeah I don't think it's 100% but I think I think it's part of it for sure I think we're good to go yeah, I think we're pretty good. 
Do we, we got, need fuel? We got we got no money. <laughs> um, the fuel. Let's see here. We got eighteen point seven five. I think fuel. we're pretty good. Yeah, we're good. At well, least for the next trip. Yeah, let's get out sure. of here. All right. The farmland. Going to see Herschel. Yep. <laughs> Uh, we're always good on food. Yeah. It's because I scavenge so much. This game hands hands food out like candy. <laughs> Lawn cracks oh my his skull God, again. again. Dude. It's just healing from the first time. You need to relax there, Lon Chaney. <laughs> it's all those stunts that he's doing. Yeah. Or the movies. A heavy fog rolls in. You are forced to drive more slowly. Okay. Your battery was sabotaged by a bandit, but you have an extra. Thank goodness. There's the farm. You see the remains of another party before you. Would you like to stop and look? Yes. Disco. <laughs> Cause unknown, but we blame Travolta. <laughs> I like that. All right, here we go. This is one of these things. Oh, shoot. Sky clears up. <laughs> <laughs> They're awesome looking. I love the look of these zombies. They're little tiny one pixel teeth. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. I'm telling you, I want to get this stuff framed on my wall. I would get that one. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so Lon needs a med kit. Yeah. Give sure. Lon there a med kit. And uh, rest an hour, I suppose. Yeah. Well, let's let's see what the uh, zombie activity medium. If I scavenge, does that count as resting too? I don't, I don't believe so. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna scavenge while well, scavenging is good because okay. if I rest, yeah, you can rest and then later. zombie activity goes up. Mm -hmm. Then that's bad. Yeah, so and they're scavenge. they're not hurting bad enough for. Yeah, I'm gonna scavenge now. Yeah. Yeah, med kit. Hot dog. I like how he puts his hands up. He's like, okay, okay, dude. I only ever use the rifle. It's the thing I'm comfortable with. And I feel like if I was to go into another, uh, into a situation like this with a different weapon, I'd screw it up because I don't really know how to use it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Oh my god! Uh, I'm just playing keep away at this point. I'm not gonna waste my ammo if I can outrun him. That one's coming fast though. Holy crap! That uh, guy was coming really fast. Med kit, 250 ounces of food. Yep. Do it again. Rinse, repeat. <laughs> oh yeah, 50 bucks. 50 dollar. Oh, I didn't even see that down there. How long was that there? It just got there. Oh, okay. <laughs> that other survivor is stuck on a tree. I noticed that. Jeez, man. Ah. God, they're starting to overwhelm me now. Yeah, they're like getting faster too, it looks like. It seems at least. It's going to cut out before I get there. Nope, got it. Oh, oh just, just in time. A <laughs> ton of food and uh, 50 bucks. Not literally a ton of food. <laughs> Scavenge again. A quarter ton of food. Piles of zombies. 
I mean, I know I, I scavenge a lot, but seriously, when, when the scavenging is good, you gotta do it. Oh yeah, because if you don't, you'll find yourself needing stuff and no way to get it. Yep. Zombies want this money. God. close calls oh yeah I'm gonna I'm gonna be doing pretty good on money here I think yeah I think you have 100 now yep. yeah zombie activity low I'm gonna keep going dude dog, hot, dog, hot, diggity dog. what's the what's the upgrade here it's combat training let's see body armor 20% less damage from losing a combat I'm not yeah, trying I'm to gonna... pat I'm not trying to pat my own back but I don't really lose combats <laughs> I'm, I'm not gonna get it yeah, it's probably a good idea not to. Don't waste your money. Oh. Oh, shit. I just said I don't lose combats. We're probably going to lose this one now. Now that I said that. Oh, my God. Oh my god. You were attacked by a zombie while scavenging and have been injured. You managed to carry back 100 ounces of food. Oh. I mean, that's okay. So I'm just attacked by a zombie. It's not the end of the yeah, world. Yeah, I didn't get, get, I didn't get infected. bit. Infected, yeah. I didn't get bit. Yeah, I must have just scratched you. Okay. And it didn't really hurt you that much. No, it didn't. One or two hours of rest should be sufficient. Yeah. I'm going to scavenge one more time. Press your I, I, luck. I, I don't want to. Well, I mean, I'm not going to get two boss fights in a row, probably. No, I don't think so. <laughs> all right, all right. Quit show button. Fries. I always think that too. Or chocolate bar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pretty good. Man, still low on zombie activity. Yeah, but I mean, I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not, I'm not gonna stay here so long that we have to start paying rent. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, we'll, we'll move on. Yeah, let's, let's, let's see what else this town has to offer and then rest an on. hour. Yeah. For kicks. Mm, maybe one more. A rest doesn't affect us, does it? I'm good. It doesn't affect the main character. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's you too gotta bad. use med kits on the main character. Uh let's uh repair a car here. I'm getting better at this, I think. Yeah, it's something that you probably just have to get in swing of, too. Even though it's difficult every time. Yeah. Could use fuel. And a I, battery. I like to keep my fuel uh, up near 20 if I can if I can help it. Uh, yeah, battery would be good. Too bad you can't trade a muffler for a battery. Oh, maybe someone wants to do that. Yeah. No. No one. I, I mean, I could wait for someone to trade, but I don't want to do that either. Nah. And there's no combat. Ch I mean, there's no uh, auto no shop. No auto here. shop here. What else do we need? Fuel? You said. We could buy. We could. We could get some fuel. Won't hurt. We're good on med kits. We're pretty good on ammo. We're good on food. We're good on scrap. Fuel is really the only thing that we need. We'll buy uh, four of them. Okay. We got a ton of we got a ton of food, man. Yeah, we do. Um, you know, we only have one battery, and I'm kind of nervous about that. But there's nothing we can do about it. So yeah. We, Next chance we get, we should probably buy one if we can. Yeah, afford it. yeah, for sure. I think we're good to go. I think so. I'm not dealing with bandits. No. We'll get out of not here. Not worth it. 
All right. Ready to go? Yep. <laughs> I say yep like it's a real thing. Well, I can say right off the bat that I think it's not a good idea to go into the radiation zone after this. Yeah, after this, yeah. So we'll head into Chicago. Yeah. Chicago. A bug gang follows you out of the settlement. Bikey gang? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so this is kind of like a Mad Max kind of scene mm -hmm. where we got the. the you kind of got to knock them off their bikes. Got to knock them. Too easy. I said a bang, bang, a big bang, a bang, bang, big and a zoom. Yep, too easy. Too easy. Fortunately, this doesn't hurt the car. No. You think it would, but it doesn't. Yeah, I know, right? Uh. That guy was close. Yeah, that was that was uh, cutting it pretty close to the. What do they say? Close to the. I think they say close to the quick. Like, oh, like cutting the animal's nails, yeah. a dog's <laughs> nails yeah. or something. I think they say that. I've never heard it that, that way. I was thinking like close to the grain or close to the line or something. I don't know, something like that. Who knows? I'm getting tired. <laughs> <laughs> All right, ready to head out here? Yeah. We've been playing uh, Divinity Co-op. Yeah, Original Sin. Divinity Original Sin, that's a lot of fun. It is fun. You can play it for like a couple hours at least and not have any combat and it's still a blast. Yeah. Yeah, it's one of these Bella has a broken leg. I see that. Probably some bad direction from, uh, what's his face there? The guy that directed... Oh, uh, Ed Wood? Yeah, probably <laughs> some bad direction from Ed Wood. Yeah, because he directed him in a couple movies, I yeah. believe. I knew he was in Glen or Glenda. Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey, Bella, go stand on one leg for three hours. That's probably how he broke it. Probably. All right. Good to go. I think he was also in, was he in Planet Nine for outer, from Outer Space? Bella Lugosi? Yeah, in the beginning. Yeah, yeah, he, he didn't he have that, that scene where he where comes out of the house? he's like going out of the house, yeah. And, and like, there's, there's like that one rose bush or some kind of... Yeah, and he's like a widower. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he was in that. Boris has exhaustion. No. Oh. Probably underneath all that makeup. Boris needs to... He needs to man up. <laughs> yeah. Chicago. Everybody, Chicago. You guys knock it off. The body is. <laughs> My family's from Chicago originally, so I know how they talk. <laughs> yeah. Like, exaggerated. Some version. folks seem to think that 12 fuel cans are enough to get them to safe haven. Ha! <laughs> Two cans will barely keep you moving for half a day. Two cans? Two cans. Two cans. It's horsepower, not bird power. <laughs> <laughs> and if one of them breaks or gets stolen, you won't be going anywhere. I wouldn't go anywhere with less than twenty cans. That's where I. Cans. That's where I get the twenty cans thing from. I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> well, where I said I wanted twenty cans. Oh. That's where I got that from. Twenty cans of fuel in the yeah, game. Yeah. I thought you were talking about like some other thing. <laughs> Like, like in real life, you're like, oh, 20 cans of this. I'm yeah. like, what? <laughs> well, let's give Bella a med kit. Yeah, I think it's probably a good idea. Hurt his leg. And, and Boris, uh, once he rests, he should be okay. I believe, because it is exhaustion. Rest for a couple hours here. Yeah. Yep. Good deal. Everybody's doing great. Yeah, everybody's doing pretty good. Car's doing pretty good. I don't think we need to worry about... Unless there's that job in town. The hit and run. No, there's not. Nope. Auto shop is there. We can buy a battery if we can afford it. 
They they don't have any batteries. Oh, those jerks. <laughs> we would have been able to afford it too, but they're sold out. You should go find the last people that bought that bought one and kill them. Beat them up. Kill them for their battery. <laughs> Fuel's doing good. Scraps good. Food is great. Med kits are good. Ammo's good. Tire is good. We got one battery, which is okay, but not great. Kind of concerning, but we don't need we mufflers because we have that Everlast muffler. Yeah. Do you want to see if anyone wants to trade? Yeah. Give me a muffler for a battery. No one to trade with. Who? Well, this was a quick stop. I don't think there's anything to do here. Uh, no. Zombie activity is high, so I'm not going to scavenge. No. Yeah, we're good to go. Yeah, I think so. That was a quick stop. Mm-hmm. All right, so I see no reason why we would go to the irradiated area. area. I don't either, really. I mean, light supplies in both, faster movement in both. It's the same in it's both. It's exactly the same, except for remote shacks a little further, but not by much. Yeah. It's better than getting radiation sickness. To the remote shack. I like how the animation of the station wagon, he's like, it's like bouncing. Yeah. <laughs> Boris trades one muffler for something useless. That's all right, we don't need muffler. The muffler anymore. was useless. Yeah, I know. So anything that Boris would have traded is more useful to us than the muffler. Yeah. Maybe it was scrap or something. It was probably nothing. It, it probably was probably was like something flavor. that, yeah, it was probably like, uh, like comic books or something, you know what I mean? Hey, comic books are not useless. Well, I mean, useless <laughs> in regards to our trip and our the, trip apocalypse. And I know, the game and our, our inventory and stuff. All right, let's head out here. Boris. Boris trading off our mufflers for stuff we can't use. Can't really use the muffler, but that's okay. You fall asleep at the wheel and crash into a parked car. Great. Look no, the station that. wagon's yeah. not doing well at all. That's okay. We, 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 we'll we fix it up. We're we can good. make it. I'm good with cars. We got this. <laughs> that one's awesome. That's uh, obviously Ash. Yeah, it looks like it. From Evil Dead. Mm-hmm. Once you are infected, there ain't no cure. Your body wastes away. You can fight it, go chasing after those rumors of cures in the West, but I, for one, don't think it's worth the risk to the rest of my family. They know to put me down if I get bit. Sure words have never been spoken. <laughs> Let's look at the uh, zombie activity high. Let's rest an hour. Okay. Get everybody all greened up again. Car needs Need, some yeah. work. Let's look at and see what the, what the jobs are. Hit, Hit and run. run. Woohoo. Let's fix our that car up. Free a charge. Kind of sparse up in the middle there. Mm -hmm. uh, Should have took the high road. Ah, <laughs> uh, ninety-seven. I usually get between ninety and a hundred. Yeah, that, that's I've what I usually get. The station wagon gets a tune-up. Let's check it out now. Yeah, still I can, I can still put some work on it. Probably one more time yeah. for good measure.
Not bad. Yeah, decent. Okay. Pretty good. Let's see if we can do do. Oh, they, they don't have a auto shop here. No, they have combat trainer. What are they? What are they offering? Combat trainer. Yeah. Faster movement and combat. I don't care about that. It's not worth eighty bucks. No, it's not worth eighty bucks. It's only five percent. Um. Zombie activity high, so I'm not going to scavenge. Mm -mm. No one wants to trade. I'm worried about that battery. I know. If something was going to be the end of us right now, it would be the battery. Yeah. I mean, we have the battery. Yeah, that's in our reserve. And we'd be able to use it. But who knows? Someone, it could be like, uh, some guys stole two batteries. <laughs> yeah. I mean, <laughs> stole your battery that, and your reserve battery. That's the backup battery. But yeah. Like, having one backup battery, uh, I don't know, man. I wish we'd have... I'd like to have at least two. Yeah, it's worrisome. That's our that's our uh, uh, Achilles heel right now, is the battery. Yeah. But nothing we can do in this town about it. Yeah. Anything we need to buy? Some fuel. Okay. Buy a couple fuel. Scrap sells for a decent amount here. Yeah, sell a little bit, a little bit of scrap. Maybe, Maybe we'll some sell. food to free up some space. Sell some scrap. Yeah, we can sell some food, I guess. I just think we should have a little bit of money. I feel good about that. Okay. And do we need to buy ammo? We're good on ammo. Okay. I think we're good. All right, then are we ready to leave? Mm, let me just do a once over here. Yep, everything good except for batteries. I wish we had more batteries, but next town maybe. Yeah, I like the guy with the Santa up against the wall with his coat open. Oh yeah, like, he's like uh, trying to sell stuff like a bunch of watches or yeah. something. Like, hey kid, come here. <laughs> want to see what I got in stock? Want want to buy some some Game Boy games, kid? Yeah. Wanna, wanna buy a Rolex for your pa? Hey kid, <laughs> I got some Pokemons here. <laughs> Pokemons. You wanna buy some Pokemons? You wanna buy a Charizard, kid? Hey kid. Three dollars. Three dollar Pokemons here. <laughs> let's oh let's get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> this Good. place is making us lose our minds. Hey kid. Hey kid, I'm a computer. <laughs> Stop all the downloading. <laughs> wanna, wanna download some Pokemons? All right, all right. <laughs> all right, let's go. Someone in the distance is shooting at you. You hear a bullet hit the car. Great. Nah, that's not. It didn't bad. really do too bad, too much damage. There's speed holes. <laughs> <laughs> a bandit sneaks up on you and grabs Boris. Oh no! That bandit made a mistake. Shoot, you're gonna kill Boris too. Am I? Oh, yeah, buddy! Hot dog. <laughs> hot dog, hot dog, hot diggity dog. That was pretty slick. That was pretty epic. You gonna mess with Boris, man? You gonna mess with Boris? Mess with the boy, you get the horns. That's right. Sound some <laughs> wild fruit. <laughs> You find some roadkill. It's probably safe to eat. <laughs> Let's eat that roadkill. <laughs> Wanna eat that roadkill. And next stop, Lon Chaney. Oh, okay. I was gonna say next stop, Lon Chaney throws up or something. <laughs> Boris won't share their one tire and ends up breaking it. Oh my god, another tire. At least it's not the battery. <laughs> yeah, but now we have a battery problem and a tire problem. Hopefully there's an auto shop here. Lon Jr. didn't close the trunk and 37 food falls out the back. That's right. Yeah. 37 food. That's the one I would want. Yeah, that one's pretty slick. That's pretty awesome. The end is near. Everything's yeah. on fire. The zombie's coming at you with his brain exposed. I, want, I, w I would want the one with Ness on it. 
Oh yeah, that was pretty cool. There's one, coming up I can't remember where there. it is, but there's one with Ness on it. He's got the baseball bat and the striped shirt and everything. Yep. Auto shop. Auto shop. Get in the zone, auto zone. Get in the zone, auto zone. So, we're, we don't need, we need, mom, battery. We need battery. We need tires, but they don't have tires. They don't have tires. Battery's what's the, 46. What's the special today? I don't know. Tinted, Tinted windows. windows. Heat wave causes no damage. That's right, I wouldn't need that shit. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's buy, I got quite an uh, attitude. <laughs> buy a battery here. Battery, right? Yeah, battery. Yeah. We need a tire too, but they don't have them. Zombie activity's low, you could go scavenging. What are jobs here? Ooh, three oh difficulty suicide? Yeah, never mind. Yeah, no thanks. I like that three fuel though, that's pretty nice. Yeah, well they're trying to tempt you. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we'll go to those scavenge. I clicked it. Hello. Oh, it took a while for some reason. Yeah, it was weird. I did click it. My food. He's like, okay, okay, man. Yep, okay. all right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Is your french fries or chocolate bar or whatever? French fries. French fries. Make me fries. Make me fries. <laughs> oh, yeah. Twenty scrap. Thirty ounces and yeah, twenty scrap. For some reason, I read it like from the bottom up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know why. Scavenge again. <laughs> I don't want no trouble, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thanks, zombie. You did me a favor. <laughs> Pretty awesome animation. Yeah, that's pretty me. great. <laughs> Man, nothing else is popping up. Eh, it's all good. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> I know what I'm doing. It appears so. It went up to medium. We'll scavenge one more time. Okay. Guess we'll uh, we'll rest. Once someone in your party becomes incapacitated, they aren't dead yet. You can use a med kit to bring them back from the brink of death. Well, there. Uh, what do you think is a med kit's for? <laughs> yeah. <you're right. laughs> Let's rest, rest them up. Uh, I guess one hour will cover it for the Probably, most part. Probably for the most part. Yeah. Yeah, it's decent. I mean, they don't need to be all the way full. I mean, you know, whatever. Yeah, they'd be all right. The car. Okay. There was no hit and run on this one? I don't think so. No, just no. that one. Repair the car. Go pack the car. <laughs> this 
special thanks to that wild gunman putting the uh, speed holes in our car. Yeah, improves aerodynamics. <laughs> Yeah, I'm getting better at this. Yeah, I think so. So, let's see. What was the combat training here? Oh, it was an oh, auto shop here. It was an auto shop here, okay. Uh, yeah, man, everything's looking good. Uh, fuel is okay. Scrap's yeah. good. Food is great. I'm just need a kits. tire, but they don't have any tires in this town. I know, right? Yeah, they were sold out. Yeah. Uh, what about trade? Trade. No one to trade. Yeah, with. nobody's wanting to trade this time around. Yeah, I mean, we could like sit in town and wait till someone wants to trade, but I don't want to do worth that. It. We, you know, we got to keep moving here. Yeah. I guess we'll leave town. I guess so. Do we need fuel? We're, we're doing pretty good. I mean, we, we can get 18 we and a half. Oh, oh, they don't have anything. They have nothing here. Yeah, what's the point even? All right, yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah. This place sucks. Let's blow this popsicle stand. All right, we can go to the cave. Or Badger City. Let's go to Badger City. Decent supplies, snow cone machine. Or light supplies and action hero. Decent supplies. Let's yeah. go to Badger City. I want to see what this snow cone machine is about anyway. Yeah, me too. <laughs> what, would, what would that serve for us? Snow cones, apparently. <laughs> maybe it would give, Maybe it would be like a food supply. Maybe, or maybe it would be like an um, like upgrade for our car. Maybe we would like oh, maybe, yeah. scoop like snow plow. It's, the, it's the Snoopy snow cone maker. <laughs> you must cross a horde of zombies in order to continue on the road. The horde in front of you is currently large in size and appears to be alert. Mm. Mm. Let's let's wait a bit and see if if they disperse. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, Ravenous. crap. All right, we'll wait a bit longer. <laughs> oh, we got plenty of food. Like we could wait yeah. them out. You know? Yeah, well, I think we should cuz now they're agitated too. Not doing good. Massive alert and alert. Again. Agitated. Oh, it's like a, I think it's a cycle. Let's watch. Oh no, we're alert again. Alert. Do you want to just try and sneak through? We'll, we'll give it a few more hours. I mean, we're good on food. We could, yeah, docile. docile. Okay. Awesome. Now we can sneak Let's through. Let's sneak through now. Yeah. Okay. You were overrun by the horde. You lost the following seven dollars. Oh, oh, that's okay. Big deal. Zombie, zombies stole our money. <laughs> we got mugged by zombies. <laughs> Guess they didn't kill any of us or even bite any of us. Forrest didn't close the trunk in one battery. Oh my God! Falls out the back. Damn Thanks, it, Boris. 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 Damn. You suck, Boris. Lon has measles. Now, Lon, okay, Lon Jr. had it. Now Lon has it. Must be a genetic thing. Must be. <laughs> but the kid gets it first. Yep. Genetically? Yep. That don't make any sense. You plow through cars blocking the road. It's because we got the we cow have, catcher. Yeah, the cow catcher. I bet if we didn't have the cow catcher, it would have really hurt the car. Probably. S smart. <laughs> S smart. Shop smart. Shop S smart. 28 days liquor. Coroner bakery. One hour photos. Gun con. Bread rising. Yeah, bread rising. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Instead of corner ba bakery, it's coroner bakery. Mm hmm. Dr. Ned. He must be from something. I don't remember what. Uh, was he I want to say he's from. Uh, Reanimator, maybe? Or maybe, but I want to say that Day of the Dead. I want to say that he's that Doctor Ned is from uh, Borderlands. Borderlands. I think he might have been the name of the Doctor from the beginning. Oh, see, I don't remember. I could, be, I could be. I could be. I could be totally wrong. Okay. I think that's a Borderlands thing. You're probably more accurate than I. That would be. All right. Let's rest an hour. Yeah. 
Uh, you wanted goodness. to kill. You wanted to kill. What was it, Lon Junior or Boris? Before, when he was sick, and all you had to do was rest. That was just a joke. <laughs> I want to kill somebody. We'll rest one more hour. I, I want him to get rid of these measles. Yeah, I don't okay. think it's working. I think you just have to wait for time to heal him. Once you are infected, there ain't no cure. Your body wastes away. You can fight it. Go chase it. Okay, we already read that one. Yeah. This this guy can shut up. <laughs> Car is doing okay. Let's check the jobs real quick. Hit, Hit and run. run. Right on. Favorite mini game or job or whatever. Well, it's definitely the one that we have to keep coming back to because we got to keep our car in tip-top shape. Yeah, and it's not super difficult either, so, you know, it does, the risk isn't too bad. Yeah. There was a game like this on Atari 2600 called, I believe it was called Human Freeway. Oh my god. And, like, it didn't get released. Yeah, ban this game. Yeah, they, they actually did, like, a... Like a a uh, kind of like a palette swap on it to change the people into something else. But, oh yeah. Uh, but yeah, it was. I think it was called Human Freeway. Yeah, I can see why that would not get released. <laughs> yeah. But it was pretty much the same game mm -hmm. as that. Sounds fun. <laughs> yeah. Roll I, people down. <laughs> I, I played that. I, I had it on like a compilation disc, mm -hmm. and it was in like the unreleased section. Huh. And and me and uh, Brutal Snake played at one time. Oh, really? Yeah, it was a lot of fun. Sounds <laughs> fun. Let's scavenge. Okay. Medium zombie activity. Oh, this is a different looking one. Yeah. There's some walls and stuff. Gates. Five bucks over there. Yeah. Dummies. Better not. This bitch better give me my money. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're making me nervous. <laughs> Five bucks. And two hundred. Fitted uh, ounces. Yup. Scavenge again. Some fries. Maybe fries. I'll take those fries, thank you very much. And that grocery bag. <laughs> that grocery bag. <laughs> uh. Oh my god. I got this. You sure about that? Yeah. Alright. No one wants to trade. Party's oh. looking okay. Car's good. What do they have? Oh, they have auto shop. Auto shop. So what do we need? We need. We need tire and a battery. And tires and batteries. The two uh, things the they two don't have. The two things they don't have. Of so course. what does the snow cone machine Let's do? Let's take a look. Don't consume food while looking for traders or while repairing. Eh. Eh. Food's not a problem. No, it's not at all. In fact, I got so much food, that's like the, the thing, you would the sell. thing I sell to make money. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which. I think food is always one dollar. I've seen it up to two. Oh, okay. It's usually one that I've seen, Yeah. at least. Scrap sells for a pretty good amount here. Let's sell some scrap. If I sell 30 scrap, mm -hmm. then we'll have 80 bucks, which means we might be able to get combat trainer at the next place if it's something good. Sounds cool. Alright, let me do a quick once over of our supplies. 
I mean, we could buy fuel. I just made 80 bucks to spend at the next place, though. But you have more stuff you can sell. Yeah, There's I do. Tons of food. Let's see how much the fuel is. 15? 15. It's still pretty low. We should probably yeah. buy some fuel. I think so. And we could sell like a ton of food, man. Yeah, we could. I mean, we have. I'm not gonna. Two I'm sets. not gonna sell it here because it's literally as cheap as it gets here. Uh huh. And it'll either it'll either be the same in the next town or better. Yeah, I get you. It can't get any worse. So, yeah, we'll go ahead I and. I believe someone uh, said hello, Caden. Oh, uh, hello. What's up? Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Let's. Uh, We're doing text to speech with the, uh, with the. Chat. What's it called? Chat, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think we're good to get out of this town. Yeah, I think so too. Maybe we'll call it at the next one. Okay. So we can go... Wichita or the Ozarks? I'd say... Oh, V6 engine. I like that V6 engine. What's in the Ozarks? Action, Action now. Right. That's the thing that makes it so you don't... Sometimes when you fire a, a bullet, it doesn't consume the bullet. Yeah. That's not that important to me. No. I do want that V6 engine. Yeah, but a, going into radiation. A, I don't know if we'd be able to afford it. Mm hmm And B, uh, you know, the radiation, like you said. Yeah, radiation sickness is no good. We'll play it safe and go to the Ozarks. Playing it safe. Like young Zaphod. <laughs> you plow through a military blockade. Oh my. Wow, that's pretty hardcore. It's pretty rough. Rough and tumble. <laughs> Bella miscounted, and you are short one can of fuel. Man, Bella. What the heck? Well... He's not the count count. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You're brilliant. <laughs> he's not the count count from Sesame Street. Yeah, he's count Dracula. He's just count Dracula. Yeah, that doesn't mean he can count. That doesn't mean he can count. He's the count Dracula. He's not the count count. <laughs> that was really funny. <laughs> <laughs> you lose an hour tracking an animal you never catch. <sighs> Isn't that a bitch? Lon no longer has the measles. Man, everything's happening in this I one know, spot. right? At least that was a good thing. Yeah. The Ozarks. That's a nice, uh, a nice shot there. Yeah, but there's no neon pixelated zombies. That's the best part. Yeah, no zombies is a good thing, though. Yeah, but I mean, as far as like an yeah. image. Okay, I think I'm gonna go ahead and call it the stream. We've been going for about an hour and a half. I think that's a relatively healthy amount to stream. Yeah, it shows a fair amount of the game. Yeah, I mean, this isn't like my normal stream day anyway. This is like a exhibition stream. Yeah, just a for fun the holiday. Special, special show for Halloween. So, thanks for watching Normal Game Couch. I've been your host, Peyton. And I've been Mrs. Elfman. Thanks for watching Normal Game Couch. See you next time.